praise the lord hi everybody welcome back uh, you have been watching the video classes on the chapter of permutations and combinations from the previous four videos we have solved exercise 7.1 2 3 and 4 this is a very important video where we will be solving the most important and five mark questions from the chapter of permutations and combinations this clubs from the previous exercises uh, there were two questions which i have left which i had left over i told you that i would i will be solving later and uh, along with that there are few more questions which have been as i told you which which would be asked for five marks and these are very very important questions okay please make sure you understand them clearly so that if they have been asked in the examination you can easily solve them okay so along with this much of introduction i just don't want to take much of your time let's directly go on to the first question of the day so here comes the first question dear students kindly understand it neatly how many words with or without meaning can be made or formed from the letters of the word monday okay assuming that no letter is repeated this is a very important condition the word is monday and repetition of the words is not allowed okay the letters are not repeated now in the, this is actually the general one the first case is special cases these are first condition is four letters are used at a time the second condition is all letters are used at a time and the third condition is all letters are used but first letter is a vowel are you following the first letter must be a vowel in the third case okay so let's take all uh, each condition one by one okay now here the word is monday the which is m o n d a y you can see here no letters are repeated here isn't it please note it down no letters are repeated for your understanding i am using different colors but you have to be very careful here what is the value of n n indicates the total number of letters that is nothing but 1 2 3 4 5 6 m o n d a y has six letters english alphabets okay now let's go on to the first condition now the condition is uh, remember letters are not repeated at the same time letters cannot be repeated also first of all you cannot use any given letter twice along with that there are no letters repeated again ओके ನೋಡಬೇಕು ಯಾವುದೇ ಲೆಟರ್ನ ಎರಡು ಸರಿ ರಿಪೀಟ್ ಮಾಡಬಾರ್ದು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದಾನೆ ಜೊತೆಗೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಮಂಡೆ ಅನ್ನೋ ಲೆಟರ್ ಯಾವ ಲೆಟರ್ ಕೂಡ ರಿಪೀಟ್ ಇಲ್ಲ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ನೋಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಡೌನ್ ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕಮ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ಅರೇಂಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಸೊ ಅರೇಂಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಅಂದ ತಕ್ಷಣ ಇದು ಪರ್ಮಿಟೇಷನ್ನು ಸೊ ಕಾಂಬಿನೇಷನ್ ಅಲ್ಲ ಸೊ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಕೇಸಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಲೆಟರ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಎಟ್ ಅ ಟೈಮ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದ ರೆಕ್ವೈರ್ಡ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಆಫ್ ವೇಸಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಲೆಟರ್ಸ್ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಟ್ ಫೋರ್ ಕೆನ್ ಬಿ ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಪಿ ಫೋರ್ ways isn't it so 6p4 as soon as i say that we will use the formula 6 factorial divided by 6 minus 4 whole factorial this is nothing but 6 factorial by 6 minus 4 is 2 factorial isn't it so this will be is equal to so you can make 6 into 5 into 4 into 3 into you can stop with 2 factorial divided by 2 factorial if you cancel this now if you, if you multiply 6 into 5 into 4 into 3 you are going to get 360 so in the first case the number of ways you can arrange the words monday with the with or without meaning no letter is repeated and taking four letters at a time is 360 ways with that idea one condition go one the procedure change agate now let's take the second condition fine now required number of ways when all the letters are used how many letters are there there are six letters out of this all the six letters can be used in 6p6 ways okay we know npn is nothing but n factorial so 6p6 is nothing but 6 factorial so this would be nothing but we know 6 factorial is nothing but 6 into 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 okay so you can use your calculator or you can uh, multiply as you know it 
and we have already done this six factorial is nothing but 720 ways so in 720 ways you can use this arrangements now let us go to the third and the most important case because there is small confusion here now look at the important condition here all the letters are used but first letter is a vowel now there are six letters one two three four five six isn't it so that means which are the vowels we know a e i o u are vowels but kottiro letters are vowels in the given letter monday the vowels are only o and a so the first letter in the first place i can either use o or i can use a isn't it so the first part can be filled with only two ways is it clear and the remaining five places can be filled in five factorial ways that is 5p5 ways so arthati dela required number of arrangement using all the letters with first letter is a vowel is nothing but 2 into why i am taking 2 because the first part can be filled with first letter can be two options o or a and the remaining five letters can be filled in 5p5 ways gotaktidya okay so this is nothing but 2 into 5p5 is nothing but as i told you 5 factorial because note it down npn is equal to n factorial okay so this is nothing but final conclusion i can write it as 2 into 5 factorial is 5 into 4 into 3 up to 1 if you multiply we will get 120 isn't it 5 factorial is 120 so 120 into 2 will give me 240 ways this is the required number of permutations this is actually a very simple question for 5 marks there are few more complicated ones in the coming uh, questions okay so let us take one by one at a time e question arthagide and the bausta let's go on to the next question so what is the second question in how many ways can the letters of the word permutations okay be arranged if the conditions are given words start with p and end with s vowels are all together there are always four letters between p and s is a tumba challenging question no? so let us take this Okay, now look at the word given. The word given is permutations. Okay, P E R spelling neat up already. P E R M U T A T I O N S. It, it would already be given in the question. Please note it down. Now check the number of uh, letters here. So N will give me the total number of letters, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So N is equal to 12 okay check any whether any repetitions are there repetitions is there are no oh, repetitions only t is repeated two times so t is repeated two times the rest are all single digits very how letter could repeat agila okay now the first condition is nothing but the words should start with p and end with s what do you mean by start with p and end with s that means you have to fix p in the first spot and yes in the last spot last and the 100 spot so first spot will be fixed by p and the 12th spot will be fixed by by yes okay and see how we can arrange these now look here the total number of words starting with p and ending with yes you can see here first letter is fixed p arrange mado hagilla yes nukuda e spot bit to bear a arrange mado hagilla that means these two letters are fixed so the only arrangement I can do is for the remaining 10 spots. There are totally, totally 12 spots. You can arrange only 10 spots. Okay. So therefore the total number of words starting with P and ending with is nothing but it is 10 P. Sorry. Uh, 10 factorial. Numerator similar problems you have done. 10 factorial out of 10 digits. Now what are repeated? E 10 uh, letters only. T is repeated two times. So it is nothing but 10 factorial by 2 factorial now since this is a very huge number 10 factorial tumba dod number barodrinda even if you leave here you will get the marks for this point okay e condition ge this much is enough if you just take 10 factorial by 2 factorial that will give you the correct answer or if you want you can calculate the value it would be 18 lakhs 14400 ways 
okay since the letters are more as i told you you will get a very big number okay so this is all about the first case let us take the second case the second case is vowels are all together so nan first helidini yavagadru letters together bantu andre you take all the vowels and treat it as one letter gothagidya vowels ella seri ondu bunch agi maadi okay now check for the vowels what all you have now the case is all the vowels are together check for the vowels uh, you you have a e i o u andre aid vowels namge actually english alli irodu a e i o u ee aidu kuda idave idalli now please make sure in this case all these five letters are together and takshna these five are treated as one letter nen pitkoli okay general agi tagolavaga these five are treated as one letter therefore the number of words with vowels together is nothing but total ig namge irodu 12 alla in rather 12 alli uh, five subtract maadbudi it would be 7 but this is treated as one letter that means there are actually eight letters are you following therefore the total number of words with all vowels are together please note down the condition there are eight words not 12 because all the vowels are treated as one letter now out of these eight letters t is a separate letter which is repeated two times so i will take eight factorial divided by 2 factorial since t is repeated two times i have to divide by 2 factorial now you might have a confusion sir e these five letters can be interarranged alwa i need not always have a e i o u so again these five letters can be all of five are different they can be interarranged in five factorial ways remember the vowels can be interarranged in five factorial ways and you can see here no vowels are repeating a e i o u all yavudu repeat agilla therefore it is nothing but five factorial please note it down what is five factorial the interarrangement of vowels the vowels can be interarranged in five factorial ways is it clear so this is the required answer for this case which is nothing but eight factorial by into 5 factorial by 2 factorial to tagondru okay otherwise take 8 factorial by 2 factorial into 5 factorial it's up to you i will give this solu- the sol- final solution you can check it yourself but in the first pu examination if you leave it here you will get the full marks but since you are having your calculators i think it is quite worth to find out the final answer therefore if you calculate the value you will get 24,19,000 200 ways okay so this is about the second given condition now we have one more condition the third one which is the most important and the confusing one nam samanyo confuse agutte let us see how we can do this now look at this condition carefully total number of words with always four letters between p and s he wants me between p and s they should always be four letters how do you do this let's try to make this by using boxes solpa imagine madkondu sketch madak try madana okay now understand this carefully uh, if I, this is let me say spot 1 there are 12 letters 12 uh, spots have taken if i take p in the first spot i following let me let me just think about uh, p and s and later you can think about starting with the s and p okay so if i uh, fix p in the first spot then it is telling me there should be four letters between p and s means 1 2 3 4 these le- spots cannot be taken by s then s should be kept here correct naalak letter gap irbeku p go s go andre p 1 nalli idre s 6 alli irutte that means now you may say sir p 2 alli hakidre s 7 hogutte exactly so next p 3 ga hakidre s 8 ga hogutte p 4 ga hakidre s 9 ga hogutte p 5 ga hakidre s 10 ga hogutte p 6 ga hakidre s 11 ga hogutte when you put p is equal to 7 then a s will go to 12 that means p i started with first spot i can go up to seven spot that means there are seven ways in in which you can do this so p first to fix maadi s na change martta hodre there are seven ways correct in the same way sir first to s sit to ade tara p in change madidre matte seven ways barutte is it clear artha aagtide thane so that means there are actually p 
पी एंड एस कैन बी अरेज इन फोर्टीन डिफ्रेंट वेस् अर्थ आता नानु बरी पी मत एस के द उद उद देर आर् टेन नंबर्स देन सारी टेन अदर लेटर्स विच दिस टेन लेटर्स कैन बी अरेज इन यूशल टेन फैक्टोरियल डिवैडेड बै इले आ टेन टी टू रिपीटेड आगे टेन फैक्टोरियल बै टू फैक्टोरियल गल इज इट क्लियर सो प्लीज नोट इट डाउन हैंड्स P and S can be arranged in seven plus seven, fourteen ways. Yau don tandre. Here dala spots. One to six, two, seven, three, eight, four, nine, five, ten, six, eleven, seven, twelve. Means it means these are the spots in which I can put P and S. That I can do it in fourteen ways. One do first P a ki S a kudu. Ino do first S a ki next P a kudu. Is it clear? So this is in fourteen ways. The remaining ten letters can be arranged in ten ways, and these two are already fixed. The remaining ten letters I can arrange in. 10 factorial out of that uh, t is repeated twice so it is 2 factorial hence the total number of required ways or the required number of permutations is equal to therefore the required number of arrangements is equal to first one you know 14 into 14 into 10 factorial by 2 factorial okay so this you can calculate using your calculators so if you calculate the final answer would be Twenty-five lakh forty thousand one hundred ways. Okay, this calculation is up to you. Need with na calculate mark ko budo using your calculator. Okay, so you can see here how different this question is. This is a very important question. Ni ma previous question papers check mark nodi. Me tumba sari dina kheli dina examinli. Okay, so this was about uh, the exercise question. This is also the exercise question seven point three. Okay, so there it was question number eleven. Where when I was solving exercise, I had not solved this question. Okay, so that is about the solution for this question. Let's take the next one. So the question goes like this: Find the number of permutations means arrangements of the letters of the word independence. What is the word here? Independence. In how many of these arrangements? Now all the condition is there. Do the words start with P? Or all the vowels always occur together? The vowels never occur together. The word begin with I and end end with P. It is this is actually similar to the previous question. Let us solve this. Okay. Now take the word. What is the word? Independence. Spelling tap barkondre entire question or solution tap pagurte. So please note down the word carefully. Now note down the words I N D E P E N D E N C E. Total how many letters? One two three four five six seven eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Once again, there are twelve letters here. Now, out of these twelve letters, look at the repetitions. Repetitions is one e, one, two, three, four. So e is repeated four times, and next n, one, two, and three. N is repeated three times, and finally, uh, so the next letter which is repeated is d. That is nothing but. Two times. Now, without any conditions, let us go for total arrangements. Okay. So the the total permutations or total arrangements is equal to. Remember, this is arrangements or per, so it's a permutation. Now, remember, uh, if the if they don't say anything about the letters, then that means all the letters are taken together. So it is twelve factorial divided by out of those the repeated is four factorial into three factorial. Into two factorial. If you are going to go through it, because the letters are repeated. Now this uh, calculation work, I will leave up to you, and I will give you the final answer. So the answer would be sixteen lakh sixty sixty three thousand two hundred. Okay. Now let us take one by one condition. Do the words start with P? If the words has to start with P, then fix the first spot. aste so that means only 11 letters are uh, eligible for arrangements are you following okay so are you following total number of permutations of the letters starting with p so that means the first spot is fixed i cannot uh, arrange the p here that means there are remaining 11 letters are you following so only i can arrange 11 letters i can arrange in 11 factorial ways but out of these 11 letters again e is repeated four times n is repeated three times and d is repeated two times so 11 factorial by 
4 factorial into 3 factorial into 2 factorial. So this is about the uh, first condition. So this is nothing but if you use your calculators and calculate by yourself, the answer will come up to 1,38,600. Okay. So this is about first condition. Let us take the second condition. Okay. Now total number of permutations with all the vowels together. So vowels yavya vidave. I don't have A, I don't have E. Actually, E, I have four E's. E, E, E and E. Okay. Four E's along with uh, I. There is one I. No E, sorry, no O, no U. Okay. A, O, U, Muru illa. But these three five letters are treated as, as I told you, these five letters are treated as one letter. That means totally is letter is there. So, um, 12 minus 5. So 12 minus 5 will give me 7 plus this one entire letter, isn't it? So this is nothing but you can do it in 8 factorial way. So 8 factorial divided by out of these 8 letters, I cannot take E repeated because E is in this bunch. Now only N is repeated 3 times into D is repeated 2 times. Okay. Now please make sure you don't stop here. But rather, this is the vowels can be interarranged. Five letters. So it can be arranged in five factorial ways. But remember, previous case, uh, permutations are not A, E, I, O, U, I letters. But illi, bari e irodrinda. Illu matta repeat iro ide. So a repeat irodinu nanu divide maad beku. This is the condition. This treat as one letter in the tokondre. E five letters can be arranged in five factorial ways. Out of this, four E's are repeated. So it is five factorial by four factorial. So E one condition. Heg tagoltiri anodhna nim gotak butre. The kundi it is all about just writing this value. Then calculation part you can do it by your own self. It is very easy because you will have your calculators. Okay, is it clear? So now if you calculate this, I will give you the final answer you are gonna get. So the total answer would be sixteen thousand. 800 you can you calculate now going on to the third condition the vowels never occur to together so now already previous second case ali, vowels occur together values kandidthidini so vowels vowels never occur together case beko antandre what we will do it is from the total number of permutations i will subtract the number of permutations with vowels together arthaagtide so, makkal eshtu jana exam ali pass agi dharen tha tilkol bekan thandre. Yam eshtu jana fail agi dharen tha gothi dhre. Eshtu jana pass agi dharen tha automatically gotha agirutte. Ekanre, so in the same way, I, I know the total number of permutations which is 16,63,200. Out of this, in 16,800 permutations or arrangements, the vowels are together. So, if you take away this, in the remaining number of arrangements, the vowels will never be together you can either new separate it will take more than five ten minutes so do, just don't take that uh, risk it is very risky for me for you to find out this separately so using this condition we will use the we will we can write it directly okay so please take it so please note down this number of permutations with vowels never occur together is equal to total permutations minus number of permutations with all vowels together. So what is total permutations? Which is 166-3200 minus uh, vowels together is 16,800. Okay. Subtract it. You are going to get the final answer which is nothing but 16,46,400. Okay. So this was about the third condition. Now we are just left over with the last condition which is condition number 5. Here comes the last condition. Uh, the words begin with I and end with P. So fix the first word I and the last word P. So here comes the condition. Total number of permutations with begin with which begin with I and end in P is given by. Remember, if two letters are fixed, that means on, out of 12 letters, only 10 letters are eligible for arrangements. So it is 10 factorial divided by. Now, out of these 10 letters, what are repeating here? E is repeated 4 times, okay? N is repeated 3 times and again D is repeated 2 times. So, this would be the required number of permutations. 
So if you use your calculator and calculate this, you it will come up to 12,600 number of ways. Okay, so that will give the complete solution for this question. Okay, all the four conditions are done. Okay, very easy, isn't it? Provided you use your common sense. Okay, so let's take up the next question. Here comes a question from, let us see from where. What is the number of ways of choosing? Choosing and reno, select madudu. So whenever you come across the word choosing or selecting, that means this is the concept of combinations. Selecting or choosing permutation is combination because permutation is all about arranging and combination is about selecting or choosing. Okay. Moving on. From a pack of 52 cards, you are selecting 4 cards from a pack of 52 playing cards. In how many of these? So conditions are one by one conditions. Okay. Now before I go on to this, even the video in the description I'll give you a link where I've explained the, the about the pack of 52 playing cards in detail. Otherwise, I cannot once again explain that here because it is already explained. Okay. Now take up the solution. Now please note it down. Here, N. So total playing cards are nothing but 52 out of that how many should i select r so number of selections is only four okay therefore total number of selections so total combinations so total number of combinations is nothing but 52 c please don't forget it is c because it is combination so 52 c4 that is nothing but use your formula 52 factorial divided by 52 minus 4. So what is 52 minus 4? You can directly write 48 factorial into 4 factorial, which is R factorial. Because matte formula n pirubeko. What is NCR formula? Formula of NCR is factorial n divided by factorial n minus r into r factorial. Okay. Idin maribardo. This is the difference between NCR and NPR. Okay. So calculation work nimge bitini. The answer you will get it is nothing but 27,0725 Andre 2,70,725 ways of combination. Okay, this is actually the general Yaude condition. Now I will take uh, one, one by one condition. Okay, now let us think about it. Okay, now look here. Four cards belong to are of the same suit and there. Now, how many suits are there in 52 playing cards? Now, go to there are four different suits. One is diamond, one is club, one is spade, one is heart. Correct? So, question is, four cards are of the same suit. So, four cards are of the same So, that means, uh, out of three hearts, I can get any four hearts. Correct? Sir, hearts are the diamond. So, that means, or, or and usually, now will Plus the gold theory. Okay. Or I can get out of the 13 diamonds, I can get any diamonds. Even this is allowed because this would this means four cards from the same suit. So this will happen four times because Nalak suit will be the way. And already a video they'll explain more than please nodi. Hearts in the Nalaku, diamonds in the Nalaku, Atwa uh, clubs in the Nalaku, Atwa spade. Uh, suit linda nalaku you can do it in any of these three all the four uh, combinations are allowed arthakidiya pelleli athwa 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 ant baruto there or wherever you get or you will get plus because all the four can belong to same suit and this one selection is completed this is are all next options whenever you get uh, the other options you always take plus are you following? Because four cards are already selected. You already nalak select ago gide. In any idrally inter selection silla. That is why when you are going for the next option, you take plus four. Okay. So this will be nothing but. You can see thirteen C four. It is repeated four times. So it is four into thirteen C four. Okay. So this is nothing but. It is four into uh, thirteen uh, factorial divided by. 13 minus 4 is 2. 9 factorial into 
4 factorial. Okay, so calculate more than nimge bittani. If you calculate this, the final answer will be uh, 2860 ways. Are you following? This calculation part, I will give up to you. Nive calculate more beko using your calculators. Okay, now let's take up the second condition. Now please understand the second condition. This is entirely different. Four cards belong to four different suits. Andre naalak bunch ato naalak set and tene nilta idhi. Prati set in the one on the card be kante. Set andre suit. Okay. Prati suit in the one on card on andre. As I told you, there are four suits each of thirteen cards. So as I told you, first suit in the one do. I told you there is. This is not complete. That is why I am taking multiplication. From the heart, I am taking one card. From the diamond, I am picking one card. From the club, I pick. I am picking one card. And from the spade, I am selecting or picking one card. So this is complete uh, combination. Complete selection only. Nal card selected because that is why here I am taking multiplication. Please confuse Agbedi. There is a lot of difference between this case and this case. So four cards of four different suits, Andre. Each card from each suit. So there are four suits of thirteen cards each. Out of each suit, one can be selected in thirteen C one ways. So thirteen C one into thirteen C one into thirteen C one into thirteen C one. And we all know n C one is nothing but n. So it is thirteen into thirteen into thirteen into thirteen. So this will be nothing but thirteen power four. Okay, so use your calculator and write the final answer here. Since you will be getting a very big number, it is enough if you just leave it here. So 13 power 4 is a very huge number. This to brother name ke kandi thavaglo full answer, sorry full marks kordo thare. Okay, provided yarade condition kele thare. Uh, exam le aido condition jotel kele be konthi la. They may just ask any two or any three. Okay, but I believe all the five cannot be asked together because it would be too much for five marks if all the five are together. Okay, now let us take up the third condition now. So the next condition is, all the four R's should be face cards. Therefore, the total number of combinations with all four are face cards. Face cards they have here. Then purely king, queen, and jockey. That is K Q J. Prati suitalu more face cards are there. So totally, how many face cards are there? So three face cards into four. That is nothing but there are twelve face cards. Are you following? Face cards are totally twelve. Out of this twelve, I have to select any four. This can be done in twelve C four ways. So twelve C four is nothing but twelve factorial divided by twelve minus four is nothing but eight factorial into four factorial. Okay. So please use your calculator and calculate. This will come up to four hundred and ninety-five combinations. Is it clear? तो बस सिंपल ही रहते हैं, but ये नहीं तो इंद्रे कंडीशन सार्थक मार्क कर बिको। Okay, now let us take up the next one, which is the condition number four. Now the fourth uh, case is two are red cards and two are black cards. Now coming to this, the total number of combinations with two red cards and two black cards. Actually, we know out of fifty-two uh, total playing cards. 26 are black and 26 are red isn't it so out of 26 black cards i will select two black cards and out of 26 red cards i will select two red cards is it clear so is it clear so out of 22 black cards sorry 26 black cards i'll select any two in the same way out of 26 red cards i will select any two remember this is half of selections नालक जोतेल सेलेक्ट मार्ग बेको सेपरेट सेपरेट सेलेक्ट मार्टी रोड रिंदा मल्टीप्लिकेशन तो कुंडी दिनी प्लस अल्ला बिकॉज़ प्लस यावक बरते इफ द एंटायर इस सेलेक्टेड फ्रॉम वन से सूट इटसेल्फ और वन कंडीशन आवक इल्ली फोर बंतो उन्हें नेक्स्ट कंड तो गोले वाका प्लस तो गोले दिनी सिंस हियर � That means this is not complete selection. That is why I am taking multiplication. Students get ill confusion, brother. Sir, can you say plus double to the answer multiplication? Yeah, okay. Plus, yeah, what to call it? Any complete solution? Complete selection? Mugdo gidre? Ill complete selection? Mugdilla? Yerad matra to kundi dinne red cards inda. Mikki the red cards black inda to call it drinda. Yeh yeradu seri complete selection agudo. That is why it is multiplication. Okay. So east bandad mele. This is simply you can write it as. 20 C2 into 20 C2, so 26 C2 is two times. That is two into 26 C2. Correcta. So this is nothing but use your calculator. 
2 into so it is 26 factorial divided by 26 minus 2 will give me 24 factorial into 2 factorial okay so this is nothing but e2 factorial 2 factorial cancel i2 namgini illu liyadu 26 into 25 waste yake antandre e24 factorial bekare barkolana 24 factorial by 24 factorial it will get cancelled so i am just left with 26 into 25 you can calculate this you will be getting oh sorry 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 students 2 times zero drinda idu plus thagondre a actually a plus a is 2a it is a into a actually you will be getting 26 c2 whole square i am very sorry 26 c2 whole square barute okay so this is nothing but you can check this it is a uh, 26 into uh, 26 factorial thane. so let me write 26 factorial divided by 26 minus 2 is 24 factorial into 2 factorial whole square okay solution mod banana so this is nothing but 26 factorial i can write it as 26 into 25 24 factorial barkon becker cancel modana divided by 24 factorial into 2 this 24 factorial gets cancels this 2 cancels with 13 remember it is whole square okay so this would be nothing but so this will give me uh, 25 into 13 is 325 square so if you take 325 square you will be getting 105625 which will be the final answer Please, uh, mistake new follow Hope Okay, okay. So this is about the condition number four. We have just left out with one last condition, which is condition number five. Okay. So the final condition is cards are of same color. Okay, same color Okay, so look here. Total number of combinations with four cards are of same color so that is nothing but now we know there are only two type of colors one is re uh, red the other one is black now look here please kind of see the difference between this condition and the previous condition so all the four cards i can select from black cards itself you black cards or means plus the four cards can be selected from the red cards are you following so please that see the difference between this and this okay there it was incomplete combinations here all the four can be taken from the same color so that means all the four from red or all the four from black that is 26 c4 plus 26 c4 okay so this is nothing but uh, now you can take two times 26 c4 Okay, all the confusion I go to, ill matte prati sari mistake maada kogala. Life alone one sari one sari mistake ma agbud. Okay, so this is nothing but two into you can use your uh, formula twenty six factorial divided by twenty six um, so, uh, minus four is twenty two factorial into four factorial. Okay, so this is nothing but two into numerically twenty six. Let me start with twenty six into 25 into 24 into 23 let me stop with 22 factorial divided by 22 factorial into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 which is 4 factorial okay out of this 22 factorial cancel now 4 threes are 12 12 twos are 24 e 24 cancel so final if you calculate all this so if you take 2 into 26 into 25 into 23 calculate modi nimge final answer 29900 that will be the final answer for this question okay dear students nam nodidivi tumba challenging questions ee session alli maadi irodu illige actually nim five mark questions mugdilla innu eradu moru idave adanna nam next session alli madona okay so make sure this is there is another continued session of this session where we will be solving few more important five mark questions from the chapter of permutations and combinations okay so hope you have enjoyed this session and uh, learnt a lot of challenging questions from this chapter okay so if you feel you are benefit benefited from this video then you can kindly like the video 
Fine. So 